Okay, so I'm going to talk about CartoDB, which is this uh, web service for um, easily building maps with the data you have. Uh, the first time I do this kind of presentation, so please forgive me if I'm not really into it. So this is the the main the main page you can. Just sign in. You can get a free account like this. Basically, creating a new user sets up a third level domain name, so you have your, your nickname.cartodb.com, and the free account gives you uh, five tables up to five, and the possibility to, to store five tables and make them up with them. Uh, creating tables is very easy, you just can insert the URL to the, to the data, or you can just drag and drop the file. I downloaded some data. Just take a zip file and drag it on the uh, on the page. It will be imported into a post which is database. And it will be ready to be mapped. Here you can see all the data you have. Now, for example, you can see that the data downloaded from the province of Rome has some problems. There are a couple of data which are completely outside of the province. There are no problems. The really access cost for demonstration purposes. Okay. Anyway, you can you can change the background map if you want between the map box, the market maps, Google Maps. any SQL query to, the, to determine what's, what's on the map, for example, there's some tests here. Uh, there should be a portal to do or something, I mean, I believe.
Now, for example, if you combine this with the power of most G's, you get a more complex phase. For example, I have three years and this is on the axis part, which are 500 meters at most. You get error messages right here. the access points which are 500 meters around <coughs> you can also style your map <coughs> you have grenade style so you can uh, you can use your own carpet CSS which is a, a style sheet like CSS like syntax for yes, This is part of the 
open that to the province of Rome. Yeah, the Swiss was downloaded from the open that You can try going there and see if there is anything else interesting to know now. It wasn't easy to find. It's already zero points and that. It's not just points, it's often, for example, here you have the polygons. You can use a width that for this time, for example, just pick your column. Bigger stroke, change the color of the stroke. This kind of I don't know what you're doing now. Anyway, you can add tags to your, um, to your tables. Must be a problem with the connection for long you out after ten minutes. Oh, nice. <laughs> so <laughs> it's not me. Okay. Uh, <laughs> don't use the message. <laughs> Anyway, uh, you upload all the data. What was my name? Well, 
Do you remember what you name a youth? No. History. Very distant from my You can also uh, use data from multiple tables within a single map. So, for example, I can run uh, a query which <coughs> show you, shows you the Wi-Fi spots which are within <coughs> the, the parts. Denominazione, scrivere. Denominazione. Dark shape files. Shape files are limited to any characters for the big names. So, again, they are changing when you the presentation. So now you have all the Wi Fi spots which are within public parts of the world. That's another example of how you can, what, what you can do with. Uh, Put that update again. For example, to thematize the parts by the number of what I suppose. Since you change the query, you are you have a different set of attributes available. So the style doesn't apply anymore because the style makes uh, references field names, and you are changing the field name by the value of this But here we have count, so we can make a different color based on the amount of Wi-Fi spots available.
I mean, so. Some question. Uh, could you briefly explain what, what, what are the technologies behind that And uh, still another one, because of the question. Is it possible to expose uh, the maps as a uh, OGC web service at some point? Or I should, uh, I'm uh, better to use them only within the there is no OGC interface. Okay, so how do you see it? No, open just special constraints and interface, not WMS or that. The usual way you, have, you interface with this system is uh, with GeoJSON, which is the, the one side of interface, uh, standard interface. So there is a REST a kind of de facto standard for there is a REST API to yeah. to work. Exactly. Okay. It's a full map API. Uh, there is a map API which lets you access the files. These are all as we said before, these are rendered by map okay, by the technology. Uh, the database is post GIS. I won't focus here. Good. Um, the the rendering is performed by mapping. And uh, there are two, uh, two API. One is the SQL API, which can give you JSON responses or other formats. You can choose between JLJSON, SVG, Shapefile, KML. And last week I added Topo JSON for the output. So that part is made with uh, Node.js uh, server. 
Um, that way you can also get vectors, for example. <coughs> Somebody asked about the performance. If you have a few points and you're not scared about transferring vectors, you can do it, right? You make request to the SQL API and get back to the data. <coughs> render it on the client. Otherwise, if you want, if you want to render the file API, which you, you pass it, the SQL and the type CSS, and you get back types. No, this is another thing. Did you answer your question, or is there anything else? Or maybe I, I left some, uh, some other technologies. The is great for the, this part, for the, the UI. For the UI. And the viewer? The viewer? The mock viewer? Is it common lines? Uh, no, no. Okay. I think it's different. Different, okay. And uh, as far as I remember, is it possible uh, to download the source code? Or uh, is, the, is that still this yeah. So uh, anyone could, uh, for example, uh, you can make uh, your own my own instance of it. Yeah. Yeah, the code is distributed with a uh, with BSD license. So you can just download it and install it on your machine. Uh, the URL is on the main website. It's, it's on it up. You have CartoDB, which is the main uh, web uh, service, and then you have uh, CartoDB SQL API, which is SQL API, and we have CartoDB, which is the Tyler API, the Mapping API. A 3D tech component here puts with them together. And there are instructions about how to do this. <laughs> But there is, a, there is also a cartel db.js module which you can use from JavaScript to simplify the access. So it makes it an easier access to the either or SQL API. Uh, that's it. I don't know if you want to, to take a look at the data. Yeah. 
it's that one. I mean, that one is the specific at the set, but the first part you see the www.opendata.provincia.roma.it. <clears throat> this, is a, this is a little bit more dense, right? We can more. There is this, but uh, for example, the boundaries of the municipality of Italy. Can you do uh, geocoding? Yes. Uh, there was a data set with that which didn't. I mean, it was provided by the province that didn't have. Yes, we can. Actually, I mean, if you provide. You remember uh, which one? Yeah, you, you provide the, the, the column. You tell it which column contains the address and it computes the, the location. The uh, black one. Like to the longitude. It computes the full job of the object. Yeah. And uh, which service does it rely on? 
There are no other questions. I don't know. Uh, just one thing. Uh, if you want to try it uh, with uh, uh, a three months free uh, offer for, for you, for you whatever you want, you just have to enter your phone name. Let me see. 
I'll tell you exactly what it is. You have, not, you have, you have, uh, you have three plans which give you up to five frequencies and up to five megabytes. Okay. If you want to create more, you need to. Even if you want to make it for example. Sorry. The pricing plan is very easy to cost on the data on your own server. But uh, anyway, you can download the application and you can you can install, install, it, install it, on it on your own machine, of course, and you are not you don't pay for the software. You don't pay for the software license. The, the software is licensed to the public. But if you want to use their machines, which also come with their with our support, you can buy this kind of plans. So for example, three dollars per month, you have up to ten tables. Uh, if you want to try one of these. Uh, I don't know if you can read it, but anyway, this is the option. If you want, I'm not a safe person. Anyway, whoever wants up to 40 people can get this discount, the first spot. If you want it, you, you, you come to me if you can read that. Okay? Okay, thank, thank you. you.